Tuesday, October 17th, day two of the ongoing Diocesan Pastoral Week celebration. What took center stage on day two of the ongoing and phenomenal Pastoral Week celebration in Kumbu Diocese, holding in the St. Jerome Biblical and Pastoral Center, was the clergy assembly. Bishop George of Kumbu gave an opening word to the close to a hundred priests who came together for this resplendent affair. His address was marked by three words, boredom, transition, and synodality. I have three words I want to use during my introduction. The first one is not a very comfortable word. Boredom. It should be noted that this resplendent affair, the 26th edition of our Pastoral Week celebration at the diocesan level, is taking place simultaneously with the ongoing Synod on Synodality in Rome. In line with the theme for this Pastoral Week celebration, be the shepherds of God's flock that is pleased under your charge. Drawing from 1 Peter chapter 5, the verse 2, the bishop defined to the Kumbo clergy the expectations of the church on what a true shepherd is expected to be, and especially in these difficult times in Kumbo. Given that for our priests, a pastoral week celebration is a time of fellowship, reflection, and renewal in fees. The clergy of Tatum Deanery, under the leadership of their dean, Father Richard Tawe, presented a paper under the title, Shepherding as an Inherent and Ardent Task. Their goal was to get our priests reminded of the shepherd's task, which according to the Holy Book, is to feed, to restore, to protect, to know the sheep, to lead them, to serve, and to be a model. This had been a challenge, especially in this time of war in Anglophone Cameroon. This paper is aimed at helping us priests in the Diocese of Kumbu to recapture the reasons for which we were called, assess ourselves again in the light of that call in order to make positive strides towards our vocation in concrete and relevant ways. The entire objective of that presentation was on being true shepherds after the heart of Christ, especially within the framework of the upheavals we are going through now. And uh, we tried to uh, invite every single priest and pastor there present to configure themselves to Christ, who was caring, who was loving, who was not like uh, the one who would escape at the face of challenges. After the workshop, the entire assembly had Holy Mass at midday, presided over by the bishop and preached at by Father Edwin Boye. And at 4 p.m., the assembly reassembled for a plenary session, marking the last major event for the day. The take-home message about uh, the pastoral week and the presentation today was about shepherding. And I'm so happy that I'm a priest, I'm called to be a leader and a shepherd to take out the flock. And it was not like only on the part of the priest. So the, the Christian also had to support us in the work of shepherding. I'm so happy with the Tartum Dinary that the presentation was good. And I've learned a lot on leadership and to be a good shepherd.